hey guys the reason i'm sharing this video is for anyone to be encouraged be appreciated no matter how little it is okay so i'm sharing this video not just because i just want to show um the four place i have no i just want to show that anywhere you are just be comfortable as long as you are happy one day god will lift you up okay so don't just cry say ah i don't know why others are living in big upstairs this that mansions and i'm living in bungalow i'm mean, living in chaos and yes living in big and that god knows why when your turn comes see don't be in a competition with anybody that is just number one mentality you have to put in it don't be in a a competition with anybody allow anybody to move well anyone that gets there before you fine just thank god and celebrate with them your turn is coming okay see me i prefer it here starting off my life like this i know that one day that's my dreams to all come true so i'm just sharing this video to encourage anyone in in this level with me I'm encouraging you that we all should be patient that one day our blessings will flow. God makes a blessing for everyone. Look at it. I have my peace. No one disturbs me. Not for me now going to rent and uh, just to claim a big family and I will go and rent a big house in a big area and at the end of the day they will be knocking me. Come and pay your rent. Come and pay your rent and I don't have the money. So what's the need? Now here is my private compound where we are able to raise this one room we are able to raise this one room for ourselves to manage for now and wait for God's blessing. So, what are you saying? I enjoy you so be patient, be courageous, keep doing what you're doing. One day, heaven will pay and surely we all will be blessed and achieve all our dreams and dreams. Okay? So, thank you if you find this video interesting and helpful. Just know that it is from Original Blessing TV. Thank you so much for watching. morning welcome back again to my channel today is a beautiful morning here in portacos and today i'm going to show you my house my compound where i stay as a family of five okay so today is just like a tour okay it's a very small place and i will share with you guys okay so right now i just finished sweeping mm -hmm. And I have to announce to you guys, I spent close to three months in the house since I put to bed. And by next month, September, will be my child dedication. And then, after the dedication, I'm going to start my business back. I do fruition business, but now I think I will schedule it. But whatever that comes out when I start, you guys are going to know. But just know that I'm going to start back after next month be my daughter's dedication then when I, whatever that i planned out concerning my business i will let you guys know okay so but today video i'm going to show you around my house show you things you need to know show you where we stay as a family of five okay in case you don't know i'm a family of five living in one room so let's go so this is my shop this is the entrance it's locked now, so this is how it's looking. Yes, 
just this is the entrance gate, the one that faces Mero, the front is. This is it, front of the shop. As you can see, it's in right in my house. And this is the gate, the entrance to the compound. All right. And see where this shop is located. This is my street that can lead you out to the main road. Okay. So from the main road to my shop, to my shop, to my gates. Now we are going inside. Let me show you things. And these are my neighbor's house. Okay. These are the house facing opposite me. All right. So now I'm going inside. Yeah, I'm going inside. Let me show you inside. This is the back door of my shop. So from here now, you will enter the shop through this back door. If you don't want to follow front, okay? Are you saying me? So it has a protector. Then you go in. Hey, I don't know. Let me unlight. Yeah. See, now the shop is empty for now. This is the front door that you open and people will see what you're selling. So, I don't know if you can hear it's dark anyway, but I didn't own this light. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, this the shop is empty now because since I put to bed, you know, we have not been opening. All we do is that few people that come, we're selling up, selling up to restore. When I start now, I'm going to restore by God's grace. This is where I manage. This is where original blessing money. This is my fridge. This is Pepsi fridge. We bought it. So it's not a gift. We bought this one. But so many that have it, their own was gift, but we bought it. We waited for them to gift us, but no way. So we have to buy our own. This is double. So it is um, two in one. Look at this is how big it is from down to this up okay so i stock drinks or any kinds of drinks in there okay so when i start you guys are going to see how it will look when, when drink is inside so you now open it to double it has to open it like this you open like this you open like this okay that is for my fridge see this down thing i don't know is rusting from here whether is this long time not to use just removes but I will, I will, we are going to repaint it it's all working it's all fine so you close it this way and you close this way i have another fridge this one i mostly use it for pure water it's on already now so it's on already we use it for pure water and some drinks because it cools fast too so, but mostly we use it for pure water. This one is meant for pure water. Okay. It's a white fridge portable. That's what I use in my shop. And these are my showcase. I put a lot of things, good snacks, my, you know, normal things, milk and all the rest. They are in here. We just bought this thing yesterday just to be keeping them. Not that we have locked permanently so that we don't lose our customers. Okay, we keep picking things one one. When I come out of a mobile, I'm going to start back my business fully. Okay, I have another fridge over here. This one is mostly my fridge I use inside house. But because I'm having a lot of customers then and they are complaining, things are not that cold. Because when I food is too, before you know it will finish. So I have to bring this one from inside to my shop. That's why I don't have fridge inside, inside my house now. So I use it here to stock drink. And it cools things faster. If I want quick and easy, couple with this thing that we are using prepared meter. So as we use prepared meter and I don't want to consume my light much, I use this one to cool things fast than ever. Okay, this is my television. It's connected through the house. Okay. This is just basically things about my shop. So when I start, you guys are going to know. I just want you to take a knowledge of what I do for a living. Okay. Guys, see these coconuts. 
so this coconut is two see this other one and see this one it's supposed to be more than this a friend of mine gifted me this coconut she's an Hausa woman so she was my friend i used to do a lot of things for her then as a friend so she gifted me this and said i should plant it she gave me many but because of space i don't have much space so i just planted only two and look at the two now this is my five years in marriage she gave me this thing when i've not even think of getting married so she said i should plant it and start making it because inside her compound she has this coconut and the coconut was very sweet so she said since you are my friend plant this to be remembering me and look at the coconut now i started giving birth this is the first birth we have not tested it here so let's see it I so much love this coconut and it answer quick once you enter this long ground does not even affect it and these are all around my compound I plant centimes here those things that we need that my bitter leaf my scent leaf my bitter leaf these are the crates I use in doing my business so I just pack those empty crates outside when I start I will use them and buy drinks okay over there is my neighbor's roof and these are my own compound. This house here is my coffee's house where my chickens, all those my chickens stays at night. Okay. And this is my house. This door that you're seeing here is the entrance of my house. Okay. And this is the back door for the shop. Being in this one room in this my private compound is better than being in oh this file it's better than you know living in a public like this i just take it like my private flat i'm enjoying it my children have access they don't go out until i open gates see we have gates it's just secured for my kids and i so i just loving it i'm loving it this is where we are managing for now see whenever i wash a lot of things i spread them outside my compound so i have a very big space which even if I need to, if we have money to build, we will still have a very good space to build anything that we want to build. For now, there is no money, so we are going to manage here. For when God blesses us, we start building. Okay. So see, I have this is the entrance of my house. You open the protector on the inside. Then these are where I kept my clothes when they are not dry my entrance here this passage so i hang them here tomorrow this is um, when i keep them in the night so morning i will transfer them outside for sun to help me dry okay so this is my door we enter through like this see my kids you see how we live as a family of five this is the bed for me for now it's for me a new baby but it's meant for me and my husband and this is the kids bed so this is just the room It's a very small room okay guys you guys have seen it all so you've seen everything you've seen the house the shop so once now i am done with this i'm, go, I'm about to round up we are already close to three months and next month september by god grace will be my child dedication mm -hmm. so you all are invited so after the dedication I will not plan for my shop to start back okay so i just decided to share with you guys this morning i hope you see it and find it interesting the reason i'm sharing this video is for anyone to be encouraged be appreciated no matter how little it is okay so i'm sharing this video not just because i just want to show um the four place i have known i just want to show that anywhere you are just be comfortable as long as you are happy one day god will lift you up okay so don't just cry say ah i don't know why others are living in this upstairs this that mansions and i'm living in bungalow i mean living in chaos and yes living in big and that god knows why when your turn comes see don't be in a competition with anybody that is just number one mentality you have to put in it don't be in a a competition with anybody allow anybody to move 
Well, anyone that gets there before you, fine. Just thank God and celebrate with them. Your turn is coming. Okay? See, me, I prefer it here, starting off my life like this. I know that one day, that's my dream to all come true. So, I'm just sharing this video to encourage anyone in, in this level with me. I'm encouraging you that we all should be patient that one day, our blessings will flow. God makes a blessing for every. Look at it. I have my peace. No one disturbs me. Not for me now going to rent and just to claim a big family and I will go and rent a big house in a big area and at the end of the day, they will be knocking me. Come and pay your rent. Come and pay your rent. And I don't have the money. So what's the need? Now, here is my private compound. We were able to raise this one room. We are able to raise this one room for ourselves to manage for now and wait for God's blessing. So, what are you saying? I enjoy it. So be patient. Be courageous. Keep doing what you're doing. One day, heaven will pay. And surely we all will be blessed and achieve all our dreams and goals. Okay? So, thank you if you find this video interesting and helpful. Just know that it is from Original Blessings TV. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys in my next videos. Bye. Bye.